business, there's sensitivity with information. There's um, you know consumer protection. There's uh, a lot of things that servicers have to abide by. So so we we really do look to our professionals um, around us and our vendors in our in our partnerships to really keep us out of any trouble. And then part of it is common sense. Um, I mean, there's really a lot of common sense that 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 maybe is not so common. So, uh, but our attorneys, you know, st staying abreast of regulations and and things that are going on, especially in this environment, right? I mean, there are foreclosure moratoria, there are our um, eviction moratoria, there are things that apply to federally backed uh, or insured loans, VA, uh, FHA loans. We don't happen to own those loans, so so a lot of those um, restrictions don't apply to us. But it's it's become an important part of of um, if you do have a non-performing loan and you're working that loan, that's uh, sometimes you have to do a declaration to say this is not a federally insured loan. And what's interesting in this environment is you even have in some cases like the attorney general uh, needs to be involved with signing off in addition to a judge. Um, to, to move through like a foreclosure or an eviction if that's where, you know, the, um, where a, a loan ends up. So it's a very, very interesting environment more so today than, than it ever has been in terms of making sure that you're, you're, you know, on the straight and narrow with all regulations and, and legalities and sensitivity and privacy of information. I mean, th those types of, of, of leaks are, you know, nothing we'd ever want to be a part of. There's sensitive information. Um, you know, we also reply uh, or rely on our um, our IT folks to make sure that you know we're in compliance with any any privacy in terms of information, um, whether it's cloud based or encrypted um, things of that nature. Because you have you have you know borrower names, you have um, credit scores, you have social security numbers, and just sensitive information.